Hi, it's been a long time since I've been able to talk to you. Um, as many of you know, I've been going through a, quite the battle. When I wrote my book, The Almond Tree, Aaron's Rod, The Messiah, King of Israel, the Lord showed me so many beautiful things about Simon, Peter, and Andrew. I wrote extensively about those two and about the five loaves of two fish um, miracle that happened nearby and um, of course in the news in Fox News reported today that the Church of the Apostles discovered near the Sea of Galilee and archaeologists say that it's the ancient city of Bethsaida where um, Simon Peter his brother Andrew and Philip were from. The Roman city of Julius was born out of the Jewish fishing village of Bethsaida during the first century AD according to the Jewish historian Josephus Flavius. The New Testament describes Bethsaida as the home of Jesus' apostles Simon Peter, Andrew, and Philip. Jesus also healed a blind man at Bethsaida according to Mark 8 22 through 26, while Luke 9, 10 through 17, describes a nearby location for the feeding of the 5,000 people. That's what I wrote about in my book. While the site appears to have been unoccupied for about two centuries during the 4th and 5th centuries AD, the local Christian community still remembered where the New Testament village had been located, according to Notley. The discovery of the church strengthens our position that El Araj should be considered the leading candidate for New Testament Bethsaida, Julius, he added. A Roman bathhouse discovered at El Araj in 2017 provided an important glimpse into the area's ancient urbanization. And Mati Aviam of Kinneret College selected a site over a hundred yards from the main excavation site for a subsequent dig. The excavation found Roman era houses and pottery indicating the existence of a small city. Experts are confident that the next excavation season at El Araj will reveal more of the ancient site's secrets and plan to entirely excavate the Byzantine church. Thus far, we have only uncovered some of the southern rooms of the church, likely the southern aisle, Notley said. At the end of this season, we were just beginning to uncover the mosaics of what is likely the nave, the center section of the church. Electromagnetic imaging also suggests that there are more buildings and structures to be excavated at El Araj. At the end of next season, we expect to be able to publish a preliminary report on our first five seasons and definitely answer the question of the location of New Testament Bethsaida Julius, Notley explained. And you can follow James Rogers on Twitter, at James J. Rogers. And that's the news article from Fox News. So all of that took place right where this location happened to be found and discovered under this Byzantine church. Their actual homes where they came from. If you'd like to read more about it, uh, I'll put a link to the article in the description box. And also, if you'd like to read some fantastic details about Simon Peter, and Andrew. I did a lot of research for my book, The Almond Tree, Aaron's Rod, The Messiah, King of Israel. A lot of people have ordered my book worldwide, and I'm very thankful for that. And I just ask you to please keep me in your prayers at this time. 
fighting the vicious attacks of the enemy and we're at the time of the black moon ironically today and also this next week and this next week happens to be the ninth of Av which is very profound considering what's happening God's houses were destroyed at the ninth of Av and something similar is coming to pass so please keep me uh, in your prayers thank you for blessing me those of you have just cared so much about me and sent me vitamins and things to help me I just think you're really true Christians and very loving and you show the fruit of the Spirit of God so please help me sub uh, support my channel and if you want to give to my GoFundMe page it would really help me significantly and uh, many of you have done that and I thank you so much and also spread the word about my book because it's got divine revelations in it a true testimony that came from God and I want to share it with the world God bless you and I hope that you're blessed just by this discovery of Simon Peter and Andrew's home in Bethsaida well, I was just sitting here reviewing the video and look who just jumped up here Did my little buddy came to see me <laughs> Love you, girl. And this is the aerial footage that they took of Simon Peters and Andrew Barjona's home under the Byzantine church. Pretty exciting. And you know, as I was writing my book, I really felt like I got to know them almost like they were my brothers. And it was really special. So I just wanted to share this beautiful truth with you today and hope that it brings a lot of people an exciting hope that the Lord really does care about us and love us and doesn't do things to harm us. He loves us. Be blessed. And this is the mosaic floor, just the section that they've unearthed so far from the Byzantine church. And this photo was courtesy of Zachary Wong. It's pretty fantastic news. I think when all these archaeological finds come about, you know, it just shows that the Lord is soon to come, which will be a huge blessing. I pray this gives you hope today. Shalom.